click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, now we are going to talk about the compound of phosphorus that is phosphorus trichloride. So in this topic, we are going to talk about the different methods to prepare phosphorus trichloride. Along with that, we are going to talk about the chemical properties of phosphorus trichloride. So now, let us understand this topic. So now let's start with the preparation of phosphorus trichloride. So here we have certain reaction. So here basically P4 that is a white phosphorus whenever it is reacted with chlorine. So that is P4 whenever it will react with that is 6 moles of Cl2 it will form 4 moles of PCl3 that is phosphorus trichloride. So therefore there is another method also from which we can prepare phosphorus trichloride that is whenever we treat phosphorus that is white phosphorus with hydryl chloride that is 8 moles of SOCl2. So in that case we could get the main product that is 4 moles of PCl3 along with that of SO2 as a byproduct and along with that of that is S2Cl2. So therefore these are the two methods from which we can prepare phosphorus trichloride. So this was related to the preparation of PCl3 and now let us move on to the properties of PCl3. So here we are going to talk about the chemical properties of PCl3. So talking about PCl3, PCl3 is a very oily substance and it has a very strong pungent smell which has a density of 1.6 gram per cm cube. So here basically I am talking about certain reactions. So whenever PCl3 is reacted with water that is 3 moles of H2, the product that is what we could get is H3PO3 that is known as phosphorus acid along with that of 3 moles of HCl. So this is a method to prepare phosphorus acid. And now let us move on to the next one that is it can be reacted with organic acids also that is whenever it has been reacted with 3 moles of acetic acid it will form a product that is CH3COCl that is known as acid chloride along with that of H3PO3 that is known as phosphorus acid along with that of suppose if it is reacted with alcohol so whenever it has been reacted with alcohol so in this case I have taken an example that is 3 moles of C2H5OH whenever it has been treated with PCL3 a following HDA has been obtained so therefore this is 3 moles of C2H5Cl that is chloroethane is been obtained along with that of phosphorus acid. So therefore these are the reactions that is what I have discussed over here but there are also certain reactions that is what I want to talk about. So those reactions are, so here are certain reactions. When PCL3 is reacted with that is silver cyanide that is 3 moles of AgCl whenever it is reacted with PCL3 it will form that is PCN thrice that is phosphorus cyanide along with that of 3 moles of AgCl. Along with that, let me talk about the other information that is whenever the PCL3 is reacted with chlorine, it forms phosphorus pentachloride. And talking about this phosphorus pentachloride, in my next lecture, I'm going to talk about phosphorus pentachloride, the preparation as well as properties. But for now, this is it. So thank you friends for watching this video. I hope I will see you next time. Till then, don't forget to subscribe to channel. Thank you so much.